Hello friends and in this video I will be helping you with the HCF or the GCF of the number 15, 18 and 56 or less that. So first of all we need to do the prime factorization of each of the numbers separately. So first let's do a 15 then of 18 and then of 56 okay. So we'll start with the lowest prime number we have that is 2. Is 15 result by 2? Clearly not because it is an odd number. So we'll go to the next lowest prime number that is 3. Is 15 result by 3? Yes it is and we'll be having 5. Is 5 result by 3? No 5 is a prime number so it is only result by itself. So let's divide by 5 and we'll be getting 1. Once we get 1 we are done with this. Now we need to do the same with the number 18. Is 18 result by 2? Yes it is because it is even. So divide it and we'll be getting 9. Is 9 result by 2? No, it is an odd number. So we'll go to the next lowest prime number that is 3. Is 9 result by 3? Yes it is and we'll be having 3. 3 is again result by 3, we'll be getting 1. So we are done with this as well. Now we need to do the same with the number 56. Is 56 result by 2? Yes it is. So divide it and we'll be having 28. 28 is again result by 2. So divide it and we'll be having 14. <coughs> is 14 result by 2? Yes, it is again disable. Uh, so divide it by 2 and we'll be having 7. Is 7 result by 2? No. 7 is a prime number, so it is only disable by itself and we'll be getting 1. So we are done with the prime factorization of each of the number. Now what we need to do is we need to write down each of the number with their respective prime factors. So for 15 what prime factor we have 3 and 5. 3 cross 5. For 18 what prime factor we have 2, 3 and 3. 2, 3 and 3. For 56 what prime factor we have? We have 2, 2, 2, 7. 2, 2, 2, 7. Okay. The next thing we need to do is we need to find the common prime factors among all 3. So we have 3 here, we have 3 here but we don't have 3 here. And if we check other numbers also, we don't have any number that is common in all three okay so when you get a case like this when you don't have any common prime factors among all three in that case the HCF or the GCF of three numbers will be one okay so you can say HCF or the GCF of the number 15 18 and 56 will be one so if you found the video helpful please do hit the like button do consider subscribing and thanks for watching